Question is, Harley, can you please do a little diet review of Michelle Bridges' 1,200 calories a day? 1,200 calories a day. I reckon we need Freely on this one. Freely! Freely! Come out here. Uh, don't call me like a dog. Get out here. Check this out. Michelle Bridges. You know Michelle Bridges? Yeah. Have a seat. Have a seat. That's a slim body. <laughs> Michelle Bridges. Yes. Michelle 1,200 Bridges. calories a day. Oh, but yeah. That's ridiculous. 12 weeks? I used to do that sort of thing. 12 weeks on 1,200 calories a day. Yeah. You're going to be making all kinds of gains. <laughs> In the fat department. Hey, we're not TMW. When that's right? finished. <laughs> yeah, no. Seriously, I though. So we've got nothing personal against Michelle Bridges. Not hating. Just saying, just sharing our comments and criticisms. I used to be a, a psychopath on 1,200 calories. And also, I could never, ever go and do exercise. Like, I was always... I'd always have to have, like, stimulants like coffee or something like that before an exercise session. And that's not healthy. I was in Melbourne Airport. And I saw Mr. Bridges. I think she's a lovely person. How do you know? I'm just saying that. Get me out of trouble. <laughs> yeah, I know. I saw her at the airport. And I'm like, that's Michelle Bridges. And she's drinking this big fucking cup of coffee. And I was like, that's more coffee than I've had in the last 11 years. Oh. I haven't had a cup of coffee since then. 1999 October. Anyway, so Michelle Bridges drinking this big fucking cup of coffee. She's got this big, you know, this Hollywood celebrity glasses people use to cover up the big black panda eyes. I used to use them. Yeah. You know? That's another thing we don't have. We don't have these big black panda eyes like being punched in the nose. Anyway, so Michelle Bridges put her glasses up. I was like, wow, she's got some big black under there. She must get that photoshopped out for the photos or a lot, of, a lot of uh, foundation under there. Adrenal fatigue. Anyway, so Michelle Bridges, she wasn't that lean. She wasn't that lean at all. She was quite puffy. She had a bit of a... She's in an off, off season. She had a bit of a, bit of a bulge on her. And it doesn't make people bad people. But... If you're going out there and saying, hey, I'm the, I'm the diet authority, this is, you know, it's just fair. People are going to critique your physique. It's just fair. So if you're going to go up on stage and say, you know, if like people say, Harley, you know, you're 2% body fat, freely, just set up again. Uh -huh. Show us that belly. So let's just turn the viewers. So have you eaten today? Yes. What are, what are we eating? What's this goddess eating today? 1,200 calories of mangoes. <laughs> but that's sugary stuff. Michelle Bridges says you're going to be an obese keg kennel you're gonna be a kennel on legs on on fruit sugar. Don't eat the fruit. Yeah. Freely take it over. Take it over. What do you mean? Tell us what the deal is. Well, I speak used to, to the do, ladies. I, yeah. So I used to do 1,200 calories a day, and I was unmotivated for exercise. I used to feel crappy. Um, I didn't used to. No one wanted to be around me basically because I was just such a head case. And it's just unsustainable. Now I eat all the calories I care for every single meal. I can't, honestly, I can't remember the last time I restricted my calories. And I'm leaner than I have ever been in my life. I'm Look leaner than I'm fitter. <laughs> yeah, so you lean. Lean! Yeah, eating all the carbs, all the calories that I care for. No drugs either. No testosterone for this girl. No caffeine. Only for me, but no testosterone injections from this girl. I always used to be on the caffeine too. I mean, that was keeping me going because when you're not getting enough glucose, from your food, from carbohydrates, then your brain is going to say, oh my god, like, just give me something to stimulate me to keep me going, in some sense. And that's so, what coffee does. So again, it's a, it's a one-way street, so like it's, you go down the stimulant path, you're going to binge. You, you, you can't like trick your body like into thinking it's getting calories from coffee. Yeah. There's only so long, like, how many celebrities do we know that on the media we're seeing, they're just thin one week and then next year, yeah. blown out, cursed the alley style. And it's sad, it's unfortunate, so that's why we're here today to say, Michelle Bridges, 1,200 calories a day. It just doesn't work. So thumbs down from the Michelle Bridges diet. You get thumbs down? Mm. It's a double thumbs down, folks. It's a double thumbs down. Michelle, I know you're watching the video. 1,200 calories a day? Are you freaking serious? I want my 3,000, thank you very much. 3,000 <laughs> calories a day, banana girl diet. That's what we're talking about. We're talking about nutritious. I mean, 1,200 calories a day. Let's be fucking real, please. Let's be real. 1,200 calories a day is what the Mayo Clinic recommends for a five-year-old girl. So you're recommending 1,200 calories for grown women who have family, work, children, relationships, partners, sporting aspiration, fitness aspirations. You're not going to do fucking no training on 1,200 calories a day. I mean, like a baby is 600, so that's only double a baby's requirement. Well, a baby's baby. probably 800 or 1,000. 
Oh, it's around 600, I thought. Maybe it's just a little small prem bait. Either. No, you put it up. It just popped out. Either yeah. way, we're talking like a you know, three kilo, five kilo little bubs. And we're talking these like hundred kilo women out there. I mean, it's, it's not sustainable. Who just sort of lies there all the time? Yeah, it's sustainable. Bottom line, it's not sustainable. So, bottom line. Bottom line is eat as many carbohydrates as you care for every single meal. Keep the fat low. Um, get rid of the guilt of eating enough calories, enough carbohydrates. Because if you fo- if you stay on this lifestyle long enough, you're going to get the body that you desire. You're going to get slim, fit, and healthy. Slimmer than Michelle Bridges. Yeah. Yeah, and you're not going to cycle between this fat and, you know, like fat and then undercarb state and fat and undercarb. Who wants that? She looks pretty chunky in real life. It's almost like she's on the juice. She would be very fit on this lifestyle juice. because she's very athletic. And another thing, Michelle Bridges has to train a freaking ass off. She's like a hardcore trainer. She has to yeah. train, train, train all the time. She trains. You know, like, caffeine, caffeine. And for her to be that sort of bulky when I saw her at the airport, I'm thinking, you know... Like, if you're training that much, you shouldn't be weighing that much. Again, it's just personal critique here. Nothing personal against Michelle. So if you want to see more of these videos, hit the thumbs up, hit the like, share, you know, tell us what you want to see because we don't know what you want to see unless you, if you don't hit the like button, we don't really know. We don't really know. Oh, a little kiss. Like for the kiss. So again, lastly, recapping one more time. Stand up lovely, freely. Okay. You're going to have the freely flat stomach Slim body, slim arms, or you're going to have Michelle Bridges' chunky torso body. None, none's better than others. It's just personal preference. You want the high-protein, bloat, bulk look, or you want the slim, feminine look.